15 most satisfying things in Minecraft. Sand waves, water on lava, and secret escapes. In this video, we're going to look at the 15 most satisfying things in Minecraft. Number 15. Blowing things up. There are many tricks in Minecraft, but this one is satisfying because of how silly it is. If you don't have gunpowder or want to save your stock, you can use a bed to blow things up. Yeah, a bed. To do this, place a block near your target, then place your bed near the block. Move behind the block and try to get into the bed. When you do this for a few seconds, the block will crash into the bed and create a big explosion. Now you can mine materials easily and clear barriers without using your gunpowder. Number 14. Change your dog's collar. In Minecraft, you can tame wild animals into domestic ones. For example, taming a wolf will turn it into a dog. Taming an ocelot will turn it into a cat. And taming a horse will turn it into one you can ride in the game. But everyone loves a good dog, so this is about man's best friend. There are 16 dyes in Minecraft that you can use to change the color of your dog's collar. This trick doesn't do anything more than that, but it makes your dog look cool. And that is all every good dog it deserves. Number 13. Change the graphics. Many video games have fun settings that allow you to play with the graphics. Even Minecraft has this function. If you open the options menu, you'll see an option called Super Secret Settings. Very secret indeed. If you press this setting, you'll get new colors for your game. There are 25 different colors to choose from. While some of the colors don't look different from the regular ones, others are fun and silly. You can turn the game upside down or to black and white. By changing the graphics, you can enjoy the game in another way. Number 12. Build with Torches Torches in Minecraft don't look like much, but they can be used to build anything. If you don't have enough blocks to build a large structure, place a torch on a wall or floor. Once you do that, you can place any type of block on it. This trick is satisfying because it can make your building stronger, like when you're using sand blocks which aren't as strong as others. Or if you're setting a trap for your enemies, it makes the building easier to destroy and trap them. This way you can easily run away to safety. Number 11. Create a water source When making potions in Minecraft, you'll need a lot of water. It can be hard to find water in some areas, so you can create a source around your house. With it, you can easily fight off enemies and make your stronger potions easier and faster. To create a source, dig a hole in the ground. When you're done, fill the hole with a bucket. Get some water and pour it into each block in the ground. Now, you have your own water source that won't run out. Number 10. The Invisible Boat You can pass through walls with a small boat. That's right, a boat. All you have to do is place a boat in front of any wall you want to go through. Then go around the boat and push it until it passes through the wall. Only half the boat will go in. Now press left click to get on the boat and press left shift to leave the boat. In Minecraft, exiting a boat puts your player at the front of the vehicle. Since the front of the boat is through the wall, you'll appear on the other side. Number 9. Cooked Chicken Farm When playing survival mode in Minecraft, you have to look for food so that your player doesn't get too hungry. If it does, you won't be able to heal when hurt. You may also be unable to run fast and escape enemies, so where do you find food? You can go hunting, find mushroom cows, or start a farm. Or you can create a food source that doesn't run out. With some redstone, you can create a farm that spawns chickens and cooks them. Add that to your water source, and the farm will move the cooked chicken to you. Number 8. Create Invisible Blocks Invisible blocks are different from see-through ones made of ice or glass. They're called barriers in Minecraft and can't be seen by other players. To spawn this type of block, go to your command line and type in the prompt Give Minecraft Barrier. Once you click on Enter, return to the game and check it out. You'll see a red box with a slash in your inventory. You can use the barrier blocks like other blocks, but they're stronger and can't be broken. These qualities make them better for building houses and holding off lots of enemies. Number 7. Find a Mushroom There are many cows in Minecraft. With a glass bottle, you can get some milk to drink. And if you kill the cows, you'll get some leather and meat for building and food. But there's another type of cow in Minecraft that is more satisfying to find. They're called mushrooms. These cows are red and white and have mushrooms sitting on their backs. They can be found on Mushroom Island. To milk mushrooms, you need a wooden bowl. But instead of milk, you get some delicious mushroom soup that can be eaten to increase your food bar. Number 6. Stare at Endermen Safely Every Minecraft player knows better than to stare at Endermen. These creatures are a group of strange creatures that pick up blocks and move them around a lot. 
If you stare at them, they become offended and start chasing after you. So, how do you look at an Enderman without disturbing its glance? Using pumpkin head armor. It can be found in the inventory section. With this gear, Endermen won't see you looking because they can't see your eyes behind the mask. Number 5. Heal the World If you think of saving the world, here's your chance to save one. There are zombies in Minecraft, and even though they're slow, they won't leave you alone. One bite from them will keep reducing your health even after the zombie is long gone. Sometimes these zombies affect villagers. You need villagers because they provide goods for you. All you need is a potion to heal the villagers. You need a golden apple and some ingredients to make a splash potion of weakness. Throw the potion at a zombie villager and watch them heal in 5 minutes. Number 4. Slow Down Time When playing survival mode in Minecraft, you can work with other players to fight together and defend your team, or you can fight alone. You can use many weapons and tricks to beat your enemies, but this trick is very satisfying. When you mix soul sand and ice, you can slow down time for your enemies. Because ice already makes players slow, adding soul sand will make them even slower. Doing this will give you enough time to plan your attack or escape. Or you can keep mixing more ice and soul sand until your enemy gets tired and quits. Sounds cool, right? Number 3. Secret Exits There are waterfalls, rivers, oceans and seas in Minecraft that can be used in different ways. You can sail a boat on some, slide down others, and go for a swim. But you can also get stuck underwater. When that happens, your player will drown. But you can use this for your good. If you place a door, sign, ladder, or torch in water, a pocket of air will surround the object. Placing several objects together will create a tunnel of air that you can connect to your house. You can create blocks of water underground from your house or base to a bigger body of water around you. And there you have it, a secret exit point to escape your enemies without being caught. Number 2. Water on Lava Some places in Minecraft are made up of lava. You can't stand in these areas because lava is hot and will hurt your player. But you can do something far more satisfying than flying over the place. With some water buckets, you can place blocks of water on this area. You would think that the water would dry up, but it won't. Instead, if you place lots of water blocks, you'll create a personal lake on the lava. Even better, you can create water structures in different shapes and sizes. When you dive into the water for a swim, you'll find fish and other aquatic life. And when you look down, you can see the burning lava under the water. Number 1. The Sand Wave You know how satisfying it is to watch ripples in water? You can do that in Minecraft too with sand. You heard correctly, sand. All you have to do is find a place with lots of sand. It can be a sand world or your own field of sand. Now move to the middle of the area. Click on the block of sand in the middle and remove it. Sand blocks are not as strong as other types of blocks. So updating the middle block will make the other parts fall apart. When this happens, the remaining blocks of sand in the area will create a ripple as they fall. And if there are houses built on the sand, they'll float above the ground. Like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon.